Hello everybody, Jurassic Claire here. And today I'm going to be showing you the DS2's in-game menu. As you can see here, it's the DS2. Yay. And so, um, first off I'll tell you what the icons are here. We have the uh, soft reset, back to the DS2 menu. We have the return to game. We have the brightness. And then we have game guide, cheat code, save load, slow motion, and free cheat. And then of course on the bottom we have the uh, date and the time. So first off, um, I don't have any game guide um, at the moment. I'll show you that later. I have one of them somewhere else, but it's not for this game. Uh, we have cheat codes, we have save, load, and so first off we're going to be going to save oopsie I accidentally saved in slot 3 anyways so it made a save um, you can see that it works I'll move to a different option and then load up my old save So as you can see, the icon is back here instead of way down here. And so yeah, the real-time save works. Um, we have cheat code. Uh, we'll just turn on max money, I guess. Oopty. Come on, max money. Max money. Okay, so right now our max money, our money is at almost max. There's an 8 and a 6 right here. We're going to be paying attention to that 8 and 6. <laughs> uh, let's see. I don't know how I'm going to do this. Maybe here? No? What should I go to? Something that hides my item. There we go. So as you can see now, after it loads up a different screen, my money is now max again. So, obviously, as you've just seen, the cheats work. Real cheat, uh, real time cheat, anyway. And so, we now have slow motion. Slow motion is kind of fun. We have our great little minus and plus. Uh, plus raises the slow motion. Minus brings it down, and you have a little percentage up there. We're just gonna put it at max so you can see what it looks like. And you can tell that it's kind of slowed down, it's not particularly as fast as it was before. Um, and you can see right here, just right across the screen, there's uh, some graphical glitching. And of course, if I bring back the slow motion to zero... At least I'm pretty sure I brought it to zero. Apparently the graphical glitching stays there. Oh no, it didn't go with it okay there we go so apparently you have to click a for it to do it and as you can see the graphical glitching is gone the menu is a lot faster than it was before and that shows slow motion and then we have free cheat um, and game guide still free cheat um, if you've seen my I smart mm video it's the exact same thing just a different theme um, so we have search value cheat code and then of course the two buttons on the bottom so which is okay and cancel so if we go to search value we have enter value we have uh, search type specific value or uh, I forgot how to go down actually. Uh, here we go. 
specific value we have fuzzy search and those are the only two you have um, and then you have the data size 8 bit 16 bit 32 bit uh, you have the fuzzy search you can only use compare type with fuzzy search and you have equal more than less than differ and that's it funnily enough why is that lowercase and so uh, you have search you have reset you have view results I can't view results because that's not I don't have any results and we have the exit um, we also have the I'm not sure if we'll open it but we have the cheat code screen oh it does so we have the cheat code screen it tells you the address the value and the note I don't remember what note is but we have lock unlock and then lock unlock all these are to lock the value at whatever value you have it at set you can edit the value you can edit the address and you can remove it and then you resume game and lastly we have well actually no we have brightness pretty obvious that it works and then we have return to the DS2 menu which I will be doing so I can get to a game that actually has a game guide so we'll let it reset and we'll just go this one Wow. Strangely slow. Okay. So anyways, to the game guide. As you can tell the brightness seems to default to second brightness. I don't know why. And so if we go to the dang it. My stylus skills have not improved. So if we go to the game guide. Oh crud. Oh, monkey. Um, right. I forgot I deleted this game guide. Well, that's fine. Uh, where is a game guide? Here we go. This one has a game guide. So. Here we go, we have lost in blue.txt. Um, the text file has to be in the same folder and the same name as your game. And then you see here that it's actually fairly readable. Um, there are some strange sort of characters that the DS2 apparently doesn't recognize. Although I really think it should. Uh, so you might have to do a little bit of formatting and then you have the scroll bar which works I don't want to really move it too much and then we have the exit aside from that um, I'll go a little I'll make a demonstration about how to use free cheat later probably and um, yeah that's it thanks for watching uh, this was the in-game menu for the DS2 which is pretty much identical to the iSmart MM just the iSmart MM has a kind of pretty looking theme and this one has a kind of darker space -y sort of theme and anyways um, that's that um, thanks for watching and I hope you will stick around to watch my next video later